Hi everyone, today we will be rendering a Mercedes-Benz Maybach inside of Unreal Engine. Here we are inside of the Epic Games launcher, and here is the learning tab for some tutorials, the marketplace tab for acquiring some content, and the library tab where we can download different versions of the engine. Today we will be using version 4.27. but you're free to use any version you would like. We can see our projects and our vault. Vault is where all of the marketplace items are stored that are either purchased or added to our projects. These are the automotive materials we will be using and the automotive beach scene. Both assets are free on the Unreal Marketplace. If we go to the search bar, search for automotive materials. At the bottom you'll see add to project or purchase for free or add to cart. On the side, you can see the supported engine versions. That's important to pay attention to when buying different assets. And now we're getting the automotive beach scene. The beach scene is excellent because it has spherical dome lighting and it looks great on reflections with automotive surfaces. As we can see, both downloadable packages are compatible with Unreal Engine version 4.7, sorry, 4.27. 4. There's an update available. Now we launch Unreal Engine. Depending on your computer, this may take longer. We're going to go to the Games tab, choose Blank Template, and enable Ray Tracing. This is important for maximizing our real-time quality. We can rename our project and press Create. Once you open your new project, you'll see a table and some chairs. Ray tracing is already enabled. And as you can see, we have some casted shadows and the materials look quite good. Feel free to navigate around the scene. Next, we will take the automotive materials and add them to the project and the beach scene and then choose our project. These will then be added to our content browser and accessible within our new Unreal project, as you can see below. I've reset my UI, so it may resemble yours a little more, be a little easier to understand. And now if we go into the beach scene, maps and beach underscore p this will load in the beach scene map with all shaders lighting and geometry as you can see it's rendering quite good we have a nice backplate image good spherical dome lighting directional lighting if you uh Go through the lights in the scene, through your world outliner on the upper right hand side. You can adjust the temperature color, the time of day, by rotating the lights, and the HDRI um, intensity. Thanks. 
I'll see you in the next video.